A robbery foiled a feisty clerk fights off a would-be attacker. We're told the robber threatened the clerk with a syringe at a Pawtucket convenience store. He remains on the run. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik is working the new details from the mobile newsroom. Well, a pretty horrifying attempted robbery here to have a suspect be holding a needle and a syringe to that store clerk. And that's exactly what police say happened. And they believe this suspect may be responsible for a similar crime in Pawtucket. Wednesday night, just before 11 o'clock, police say a store clerk here at the Town Mart on Newport Ave in Pawtucket fought off a would-be robber with, out of all things, throwing a stool at him. The suspect, police say, was holding a syringe and a needle, threatening the clerk and telling him to empty the cash register. Someone came in with a syringe and attempted to um, empty the register, and whoever was working that night just, I guess, picked up a stool and threw it at the person and they ran out the back door. Claire Barwick is also a clerk at the store and says she can't believe what happened. That was a very daring thing to do. Um, you have this feeling of you want to hold on to the money even though it's not my money. You just don't want to give it up, period. And that's exactly what police say the clerk did, refused to give up the cash. The suspect eventually ran out the store's back door without any money. Barwick says she gives her colleague credit for fighting the robber off with a stool. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> that would not be my approach. Um, uh, let's just say I have my own approach. That's pretty uh, outlandish. Uh, I'm kind of surprised that somebody would go through those lengths uh, to get money. And police are also investigating whether or not this suspect may be responsible for the robbery of the Getty store on Newport Ave in a similar fashion. That one happened at the end of June. The suspect, police say, is a white male heavy build. Reporting with the Mobile Newsroom, I'm Catherine Sodnik, Eyewitness News.